We're back. Bear Bones Broadcasting, Normal Sox Baldy. <clears throat> Beginning of this broadcast, I want to remind some one that really gave me some help last night. Doug, I'll tell you. Thank you, Doug. Thank you a lot, Doug. You were there when no one else was. Have you ever had somebody show up, folks, when no one else will? Man. Really exciting. When you call out for help and you get nothing. When you yell your SOS and nothing. And someone finally shows up. Found me. Thank you, Doug. Norman with Sucks Balding, Barebones Broadcasting. It's a real broadcast that we're going to speak about. What we're going to speak about. <laughs> I want to make sure I thank Doug. Oh, a little more profile, Norman. <clears throat> I'm 4F. I've got a phony leg and foot. 4F. Beginning of the Vietnam War, I went, had my exam in 1963. There was a draft. I got my draft papers and went to the doctor. Well, first of all, it says on the draft paper, is there reason you, <clears throat> anything wrong with you? They ask you that. You got any physical ailment? I got a club foot. They gave me a doctor's appointment. I went to see the doctor. Well, he came in, take off your shoe. I don't, I don't want to have my foot shoe off. He looked at it and he said, they don't want you. <laughs> what he said. They don't want you, boy. I want you to know something. I... I wouldn't have mind going to the military. I, I realize that now. I could have done it. Even though I was well wounded before. Up here. They might have sent me home for that reason too. I'm not sure. Depending on my trainers. Depending on your trainers is who go, gets in and who don't. Depending on the trainers who's rejected and who isn't. Depends on those individuals. And how they put it together. And how they see you. Over here! Your criteria doesn't mean anything. Oh, we have stats. They are worthless. First thing, newspapers go, we're going to do a study. What did they go after first? Stats. Well, that took care of the study. <laughs> Can you study with stats? Nope. You can't. Can you take reports and do a study? No! No, you can't. How much validity is in that report you did the study with? Goose egg. You know, when something eats on the Serengeti, they ain't how they do it. Sorry, not the way the study is done. And they, dang, food, dang, food. Your studies are bringing dang, food, dang, food. In fact, they're intersections, dang, Bam! Bam! Study failure. Higher education study. Can the military use it? Why in God's name would the Marine Corps go to the advertising industry for anything? What a dumb place to go. That must be a camouflage. That ain't really what they're up to. None of those words that the advertising industry uses in association with the Marine Corps, please do not associate with a reason to go to the Marine Corps. If you want to fool with chaos, stay away from the Marine Corps. It don't match. One bet? Marine Corps don't know nothing about chaos and couldn't fix it if it tried. Now, if there's some kind of a broken thing with consistency and discipline and priceless things of living, the Marine Corps can fix that. But it can't fix crisis. It doesn't understand it. Doesn't even have the brains to witness it. Who would? There's no chaos here. There's no crisis here. There's priceless needs fixed only. Now, you see it that way. I don't see it any other way ever. Got it? Barebone broadcasting. Oh, I was going to give you a... <laughs> <I> was... <laughs> I've said this to a deck of a ship. What I was going to do is I reminisce military. 
My, all I do is place on my, my ancestry, my genetics. I'm a mascot of shit so many generations. I've drowned so many times. I think the best way to drown is don't wait till you're weak, for Christ's sake. Just take it in. Suffocate with glee. Huh. How many times I've drowned? I know what Jonah went through. A lot of times. I reminisce it a, a lot. You think I'm cuckoo? <laughs> when you reminisce because you've asked to, does that make you loony? And I don't reminisce. Not what you think. No. Hollywood has never displayed this yet on film. What I'm going through. Know that. It's far more classy and sophisticated and less mystical than you think. It's something an animal does, a dog or a cat. That's how they get along with you. Now, I reminisce where I have a... I get along with you, I'll tell you. Well, maybe the dog cat sees you the same way I do. Because <laughs> you won't reminisce. You're traditional and will not live. Some of the, your methods of lifestyle living doesn't have any association with a thought-out process at all. What you call class is not. Hmm. It's below military grade. This planet, excuse me, this planet lives below military grade. What a bat! That's unacceptable, says the military. Don't use me as the highest grade. I told the army. Recruiter, I want this to be a military society. And you know what I heard in the background in that military recruiter office? No! That's the wit of my military. When I call, how dare me say that? That's the wit of the military of the United States. Oh, I, they had me on speaker. I said, I want this to be a military society. No! I tell you. <laughs> they call army strong. <laughs> I like getting corrected that way. I say I like getting corrected. <laughs> it's falling out of here. <laughs>